My name is John Tetley, investigative journalist for the city of Atlanta. You may be wondering how I got here, or you might not be, but here I am. <laughs> this is for you. <laughs> it sounded good at the time. This is my job. I sit, I wait, I write, and I see who I can piss off next. I used to love my job, but lately things haven't been so... Hey, John Tatley, this is for you. <laughs> if you Google fuck my life, you'll get my face. Go ahead, try it. I can wait. Up until now, though, I've always seemed to bounce back. <laughs> hey, John Kentley, this is for you. I shot the recycling story. You know, I was just trying to reduce pollution, protect the environment, slow global warming, conserve natural resources, cut down on landfill waste, create jobs. But this guy probably had to buy an extra garbage can. I, I get why he's pissed. <laughs> hey, did you John Tetley? <laughs> Great story on the health inspections. Hold on a sec. <laughs> Look at this. This jerk's restaurant gave 25 people explosive diarrhea. He almost killed somebody. But sometimes, all you can do is smile. Hey, Scoop, great story on the water shortages. <laughs> if not for my story, this yuppie gardener will be bathing once a week throughout the summer. But I'm the dirtbag. Sometimes I try running, but that just makes us damn projectiles hurt even more. <laughs> and my intentions were good, you know. Problem is, the only people you ever hear from are the complainers. The tiny percentage that were negatively affected in some way by my stories. The people that benefited, most of them, they don't even realize it. Fake news! <laughs> <laughs> The iron is not lost on me, folks. John Tetley found steeping in his own miserable filth. <laughs> There's a headline for you. Hey, Tetley! Come here, I got a tea bag for you! <laughs> hey, fuck you, Scoop! <laughs> You may ask me, was it worth it? Well, you tell me. <laughs> <laughs>